all this clown on Mary Lou Jr. is a new opening gym. I, I don't know if they're open. forwarded to the voicemail for House LA. No one is available to take your call. At this home, please record your message. When you finish recording, you may hang up or press the pound key for more options. Hey, Floyd, you looking forward to getting knocked out for the first time? I know you got your ass beaten amateurs, but this is the pros, bitch. I'm gonna introduce you to the real pros. Opening up a gym in Wilshire, motherfucker. You know I live five minutes away from this. This is Charlie Zellin off. The guy that knocked out Deontay Wilder, your buddy, and the guy that knocked out your father, you fucking pussy, man. You best believe I'm gonna be there in January when the gym opens up, bitch. Oh, this clown's finished. Fuck my weather. Knock this fucking dad out. But see, with, with his dad, it was different. I didn't know I was fighting Mayweather Sr. Cassius Green took me to that gym. And the Mayweather Sr. called me out, and you all saw what I did to him. I knocked his ass out. I dropped him. I all boxed him. I beat the shit out of Mayweather Sr. I'm saying it would make for a great story if I beat Junior, because then I'll be able to say that I beat the son and the dad. You know what I'm saying? And they both fight identically. They have the same, that bullshit shoulder roll style. They're already exposed and broke through. But when I was punching me with the senior, when he was against the ropes, he, he did that shoulder roll shit. He still dropped. I've seen this clown before. If I see him there, I don't care who's there. I don't care what backup he has. I don't give a fuck who's there. I'm going to knock me with a junior out. That's it. I don't give a fuck. Come on. He's Floyd Mayweather Jr. After I knock him out, he's really going to call the police on me? Do you understand if, if he does that? Do you know what... Yeah, then he's going to be looked at as a snitch, as a bitch, as a pussy. I mean, come on. He's going to have to get knocked out like a man. This guy talked all this shit that he's TBE and all this bullshit and I'm winning 28 fights in one year. Come on, man. And now he's opening up a gym on Wilshire? Motherfucker, I live five minutes away from there, man. Wow. Fuck, I hope he's going to be there, man. What would I do to Mayweather if I fought him? Boy, Mayweather. Be his ass. I mean, I beat Deontay Wilder for crying out loud. Come on. Wilder would kill Mayweather. I mean, if this fight happens, this fight already happened. I smashed Wilder. I'm talking about me and Mayweather Jr. If that fight happens, I'm too big for him. I'm much stronger than him. I'm much faster than him. Younger than him. I have way more experience than him. I have a lot more underground fights than he has pro fights. Listen, I would kill Mayweather Jr. I'm, I'm very happy he's opening up a gym in my area. If he's there, I'm going to go there. If he's there, I'm going to knock him out. Come on, I knocked Wilder out. If I can beat Deontay Wilder, it's a no-brainer that I would obviously beat Mayweather Jr. Why do you think I want to go fuck up Mayweather Jr.? Because he's a good boxer? No, because it's a moral victory, just like with Wabarski and the Kuds. And, uh, yeah, just like that. I got Wilder. I got Senior. I got to get Junior. Like, I beat Anthony Thompson. Beating a guy like uh, Thompson or Leo Leo, guys who would crush me with a junior, the under-the-radar talented fighters. These mentally ill haters, they don't care about, about those fighters. They care about these paid professional Hulk Hogan actors on television. They're mentally ill. Their, their mentality is different. Just because they see these fake boxers on TV and they, they, they rate them like they're, oh my God, these are the top-ranked fucking contenders, champions, and no matter how many times I explain to them, no, no, these are not champions, these are paid professional actors, these are very limited boxers, they're not trained to box, they're entertainers, they're not fighters, and these haters, they're in denial, delusional, they don't want to, that's what I'm saying, I, I truly hope Mayweather Jr. is going to be there, I'm, I'm just going to knock him out, seriously, if I see him, I'm just, I'm just going to knock him out. And these uh, delusional haters are saying that I'm going to go to jail if I go to Mayweather's gym and punch Mayweather Jr. But come on, he's Mayweather Jr., man. You really think he's going to call the cops on me? Come on, but he's Mayweather Jr. Yeah, we're going to see. We're going to see who the champion is. Oh, I already know who the champion is, but when, when I'm face-to-face -face with him for a third time, seeing him twice, man, I, I should have done this a long time ago. When I seen him, I should have fucked him up. Whatever. Now... I'm getting another chance. If he's going to be there, he's out of there. That's it. Yeah, you've seen my, my last fight. It was, there was no gloves. So, gloved up, not, not gloved up. Of course it's going to be better if, he, if we go in the ring like, like his dad did. His dad gets a lot more credit than him. But 
if he if he says no, he's getting knocked out. So either way, they were the juniors. He's going to get knocked out. He's going to lose. He's going to get his ass kicked. Charlie Z, Wilder. Come on, man. If I made Wilder fly across the ring, man, are you kidding me, man? Floyd Mayweather Jr. should not even be mentioned in the same breath as me. In the same breath, I repeat. I knocked out Deontay Wilder, man. Yo, why do these delusional trolls are saying that uh, I sucker punched Wilder? And some of them are, some of them are so fucking out of their minds. They're even saying that, that, I, that I missed or I didn't hit him. Wait, are, but it's on video how I connected. Okay, so let me ask you this. How did Wilder's head cock back? Wilder. Yeah, come on, man. Yeah, this is a much bigger win than th this is way bigger than beating any Mayweather, junior, senior. Uh, yeah, beating Wilder. Come on. Like I said, if I knock out Mayweather Jr., it, it's going to be a huge step back after beating Derek the Giant, Anthony Thompson, Wilder. But it will be ultimate justice. It will be it will be the ultimate justice because he's an asshole and he's a pretender. But of course, being Wilder is better than being Mayweather. Yeah, I started training for a real fight, real underground fight that I'm having January. But in the meantime, I wouldn't mind stopping by to knock out Mayweather Jr. Oh yeah, yeah. I I didn't think he was gonna open up a gym in that way. I was like, when my homie called me, I was like, what the fuck? I'm like, are you serious? He's like, yeah. That's it, man. I'm gonna go there. I'm gonna film how I go there. If he's there, I'm gonna give somebody the camera. And no more Floyd Mayweather Jr. Yeah, I'm, I'm gonna go there, and if he's there, I'm gonna attack him. Hey, if, if you're a 50 and 0 boxer who's been in the Olympics, you gotta know how to defend yourself. That's why I'm gonna expose him and all you delusional fucking clowns that talk shit on the internet, man. When I let these go, and I, well, as soon as I hit Mayweather, he's going to be on the ground. And because of his stature, because of his fake stature, he can't call the cops on me. Because if he does, that's it. This is perfect, man. And if he's not there, well, nah, it's going to suck. But, okay, I beat his dad. I beat his friend, who's a lot bigger, stronger than him, down to the welder. 55. They're not him. He's delusional, you know. He's uh, that's for sure. <laughs>